Hi everyone, hope you're all well. Welcome to My Way Tarot. This is going to be a general energy reading for you. If it resonates, that's awesome. If it doesn't, it's simply not your message. There may only be uh, parts of it that resonate, so there'll be something in there for you. Okay. So I'm currently shuffling with the Radiant Rider Away Tarot deck today. And then we'll cut up the deck and we'll get into the reading. Okay. Just seen the world in reverse and the emperor in reverse. So potentially either you or someone you're dealing with um, could be having difficulty closing out a cycle um, in their life. Potentially to do with um, power struggles, potentially with third parties or even though just their own ego. There could be some sort of difficulty in that. Okay. Maybe a bit of immaturity, setbacks of some sort. What messages can we get for the collective, please? Oh, okay, straight out. What have we got? Wow, okay, so your intuition is on point. Just seen 111. So you're sitting here as the high priestess, trusting yourself, listening to your inner voice, knowing that you can move yourself forward. And potentially you may have moved yourself out of another situation where things didn't necessarily feel right. Potentially you may have moved away from that potential, um, the emperor in reverse. So Aries energy or one of the fixed signs with the Leo, um, Aquarius, Scorpio or Taurus energy. And this is Cancerian energy. So quite however it resonates for you. Oh, wow. Okay. We have an imbalance here with the Libran energy for justice. So you intuitively knew to know to like get yourself out of a particular situation. Yeah, because there was sneakiness and someone got caught and somebody's now feeling regretful that they got caught because now the situation could be a love relationship is now over because you kind of trusted yourself to move on forward in something else. What else are we getting here? Oh, okay. What was that? Yeah, you managed to kind of get out of your head and move yourself forward and follow your intuition with the Eight of Swords energy in reverse and then with the Six of Cups in reverse. So this situation, you know, you're getting yourself out of your head, accepting the situation for what it was, breaking free, gathering a new perspective. And this has allowed you potentially to move on in some uh, in some capacity with the Six of Cups energy in reverse moving forward leaving a situation not being stuck in the past to do with someone or something else wow yeah you're after your dreams you're moving forward to give what finding out what is the emotional fulfillment that you want for yourself <laughs> with the six of um with the six of swords energy you're moving on to karma waters you're absolutely leaving all of the rubbish in the past just decided look i've had enough you know, I don't want to be imbalanced. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. You know, um, either you or someone you're dealing with could have been in an, a happy home situation. There wasn't the stability in the connection quite potentially. Um, you may feel relatively lonely right now because you've been going forward after your dreams. And sometimes, you know, it's lonely at the top, isn't it? So bottom of the deck yeah we have the page of swords other people could be um gossiping about the fact that you kind of keeping yourself to yourself working on your working on your dreams working on your stability quite potentially as well or someone's in an unhappy home situation with a, a contract and there's been gossip about them trying to get out of something what else Ooh, okay too many cards those wanted to fall on the floor so we had the King of Cups in reverse and the Seven of Wands. You've had to stand your ground about somebody. Potentially there may have been emotional manipulation at some point. Just, did you hear that bird? Um, yeah, so I think I'm on the right track there. Somebody wants to, um, you wanted to collaborate with this person and work as a team, but they potentially may have been um, emotionally manipulative in the past and you knew that with your intuition so you decided look okay i can get myself free and out of this and then move on yeah <laughs> you you may have wanted to work on with this person but then realized there was certain behaviors that you were not going to tolerate say look you know i'm going to stand up for myself i'm going to take control of my life with the seven of wands 
you know it's like I'm gonna just persevere and work on whatever I need to work on and follow my intuition and leave all this old stuff in the past because I don't want to be dealing with that yeah you're leaving feeling emotionally imbalanced as well potentially with the queen of cups energy you you mourn this person you know potentially with the king of cups energy and when they're both upright there there are there's a love connection there there is a pair but with this person showing up in reverse and also this coming in reverse there could have been an imbalance most likely to do with the relationship or situation or etc so therefore um it's not like the love was lost but there was difficulty like you know excessively giving in a situation and not receiving or there was some sort of um coldness in the relationship somebody was withdrawn or maybe you withdrew potentially to follow your intuition and withdrew from this person because they didn't show the love and the care or try to nurture the connection so therefore this was like a counter attack not counter attack but like a reaction to go well actually you know if I'm not going to necessarily receive the equalness that I I feel like I should deserve then I'm just going to stand my ground and do something else and move on which is I feel like the, the approach that you went for yeah because you've realized that you can move on forward and have a more equal give and take situation this is exactly what I've just said right now yeah because there was an imbalance to do with the emotions with this queen of um cups energy in reverse it's like this is somebody who's usually you know upright feeling very calm you know very compassionate and healing themselves but this is somebody who's feeling a bit more insecure but i feel like you're moving away from that and by doing that you're stepping into your empress energy which is allowing you to recognize that you can have equal give and take in your life and you know any imbalance that there was is in the past as you work on your work on yourself you know you're done with the immaturity and, and the kind of games as it were so what's gonna go next nine of cups underneath the nine of cups having that realization that you, you can have equal give and take yeah because you're recognizing your self-worth here with the queen of pentacles energy yeah and that you're deserving of a new start because you are and you're wanting a new start in your finances and you're gaining this clarity now with this king of swords energy it's like you are showing yourself you are transforming here you know with these uh, these butterflies up top it's like you're transforming yourself and your mindset and it's allowing you to speak your truth and your truth is is that you you know regardless of what's been happening you want to go after your fulfillment and you're gaining that self-worth that even if you have to start all over again it's going to be worth it okay you know because you don't want to miss any other opportunities you you want new ventures to come into your life you you know you want manifestations and security whatever it is yeah and this other person potentially that you're dealing with could be stressed in another unhappy home situation up at night stressing about the imbalance that they have in their life while you're setting up sorting out yours you know and then the queen of swords energy look you're, you're so like mastering your thoughts right now you may have been at a point where there's been an emotional imbalance but then having this recognition of this different um situation like playing out the way that it has has allowed you to kind of nurture your thoughts better and then therefore take control of your thoughts better which is allowing you to sit in king and queen status um to do with the swords like the air energy as Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Now, either that or you may have been stressing about finances previously, um, but I feel like that's something that's going to come to pass. But potentially, yeah, this person has been in a difficult home situation, but I'll take another one for the Nine of Swords, actually. What have they been stressing about or you've been stressing? Okay, what we have? Yeah, Two of Swords. Yeah, because there's been an imbalance, because somebody hasn't either been going in you know listening to their intuition you know they've had to make some really difficult choices and potentially if it's to do with this love connection then you may not have been the first choice and that could have been a really difficult pill to swallow or to accept that potentially somebody else may have been on the fence but now they know that because they've been on the fence they're up at night stressing about other situations playing out in their life and with this two of swords in reverse it's like you know somebody 
is trying to figure out how do I actually move forward? How do I see the truth of the situation? And maybe they don't like seeing the truth of the situation because they're in what they're in and they've been severely wounded in this, in this sense. And now potentially they could be broke with the king of pentacles and you may be searching or maybe get getting new love into your life after a period of time of waiting or dealing with people who are in and out of your life which kept you in an imbalance and really upset and depressed with the sun energy in reverse but you're gaining that clarity that you can move on forward for yourself and not to have this worry and stress okay so i think i'm just going to pull a few romance angels just because i'm curious about if there's anything here and then we'll close off the read. Okay. So what can we get for this, please? Anything here? Oh, straight out. Yeah, this person wants to come forward and make the effort now. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. They want to make the effort now. Now that they see that you're moving on, this could be the one. You may not want it to be told that, but potentially this person who, who you thought may, may have been you know, they could potentially be the one. Yeah, wow, okay, true love. This is a romance of a lifetime. Forgiving and learning. They want you to forgive them. <laughs> they want you to forgive them. They want you to release the, heal the past so you can have more love in your present moments with this person. Yeah, there was deception in the past potentially, but they could have been lying to themselves or you were lying to yourself. But just trust that things can change. But this person wants to make the effort now. Now that they see that you're making the effort to kind of move on with yourself and get yourself more balanced and nurture your energy more, it's, it's seeing this other person kind of regretting from the past, not making the effort previously, but they could have been in a um, emotionally manipulative place or that's like the whole mind games stuff. Yeah, let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. So this person may have been quite controlling in the past. I mean, we saw that energy earlier with the Emperor in reverse and the, um, the World card in reverse. So somebody was trying to control the situation and now they're realising that they couldn't control the situation and that cycle needed to end. Or potentially you may have felt like you're trying to control the situation with how you were to move forward in this connection. But now it's asking you to just to stay positive that things will move forward when you allow the situation to unfold naturally. Or this other person who was trying to control you, in a sense, by maybe being withdrawn with their feelings and being defensive, potentially. Wow, okay. So lots of different uh, messages there. I think I'm going to actually pull just a couple from the Island Time Wellness just to get any last messages. Let's see what we get here. Anything? Anything at all? Oh, it's too many. What have we got here? The Phoenix, new phase, rekindle, renew, transform, growth, change mind. Yeah, with you moving on, they've, they've had a changed mind. They're, they're transforming their selves and you're transforming yourself. You're moving on, being happy, working on yourself, working on your finances. You've been transforming like this beautiful butterfly here. And funny enough, didn't I say about the butterflies earlier with the King of Swords energy? And here's the, here's the butterfly. Heart with a key meeting the one opening up your heart again getting together so this person most likely is your person but you're like not today you may not be able to accept or understand this situation so it's like this control yeah they want to see you because there is love here but i mean there's been so much that's gone on i'm just getting that oh like water under the bridge is it too much that's gone underneath yeah chaser and i like you so you, you may have been the chaser in this situation, expressed that you liked them, but potentially they may be doing that with you now. There could have been a change in dynamics, so they're having to watch you from afar, potentially. Or either you may be both keeping an eye on each other in relation to this connection. And obviously with watching tarot readings, that's also keeping an eye on someone, isn't it? If you, even if you're not necessarily looking at anything else. So, okay. Anyway, um, yeah, but... 
just this whole thing is to kind of help you learn from from the past um from past situations in order for you to be able to move forward i feel like there will be a sense you'll be able to move forward but it's like moving on forward with yourself first and then allowing this other person not allowing but this person has to kind of catch up or they have to kind of be on your level um to match you with your kind of newer energy so that they kind of get out of this other situation or other like mental stress and everything this confusion that they may have been in previously okay so anyway i hope that you enjoyed the reading thank you so much for watching thank you so much um, for being here and um, if you enjoyed please like share and subscribe and unless i said that already i'm not sure <laughs> sometimes i just lose track with what i'm saying um but anyway i hope i hope you guys enjoyed the reading and we'll speak to you again soon thank you take care bye for now